So what did I enjoy the most about inclusive leadership with Keras? Honestly, it was the opportunity to have structured discussions around inclusive leadership with my classmates. It, you know, the opportunity to learn from them rather than a book or a piece of paper or something academic brings to life what inclusion is all about to me, which is understanding the experience, the place that others are in and, and being able to respond appropriately to that as you lead a team, engage with an organization, frankly, just be someone's friend. Um, so that, that to me, that, that this brought structure to a classroom interaction with my peers was invaluable. What was my biggest takeaway from inclusive leadership with Keras? Honestly, this was around continuing to be very intentional about asking questions. Don't make assumptions. Don't just listen without asking follow-up questions, but try to go deep. Try to seek a real understanding of why is somebody coming from the position that they're coming from? Or why do they feel the way they feel about a certain situation without allowing yourself to create preconceived judgments? Um, it's, it's completely empowering in terms of your ability to then connect and interact in a more positive, more productive way with anyone you might meet. And I think what I'd add to that is being diligent about applying that habit to everyone. Some, some you'll find it easier to do with, others you might have to be you know, more on purpose about it, but be diligent, be self-disciplined about it, and always be willing to ask follow-up questions and truly try to understand why. So who do I think needs to attend Inclusive Leadership with Keras? The, the easy and true answer is everyone, but I think to get more specific, those that are building teams and trying to accomplish something, whether that's in business or nonprofit, that's on behalf of many, many people, are those that will, will take the most from this because it will allow them to direct their efforts in a more appropriate way for for their audience, for their target group, and, and avoid pigeonholing themselves or suffering from blind spots or unintentionally going a direction that isn't the optimal direction for everyone they're trying to serve. Something that I've taken away from Keras uh, or inclusive leadership with Keras that I want to implement, I, I'm going to cheat a little bit on this answer because it's it's a continuation and a doubling down on something that I thought was important and now I understand where that value comes from, which is taking time during the work day with the whole team not to be working, giving ourselves an opportunity to get to know each other and truly connect and just talk about life rather than life and work or how the two fit together, makes us more effective, makes us a better team, makes us more connected and we all deliver better work output as a result of that. And more importantly, we all enjoy and, and take away positive things from the experience of being on the team in a, in, in a better way than we would without that experience. Biggest takeaway from participating in inclusive leadership with Keras is find people that are completely different from you in every way and make friends with them, add them to your inner circle, both personally and professionally, and you will find so much more interesting about the world and about how you can do your job than you ever thought was possible.